My name is Valerie, I'm 17 and I'm from the Philippines. My name is Marcin, I'm 31 years old, I'm from Poland. Jane. Wherever they were born, all of these people have one thing in common. They now live in Burnley. My name is Anwar, I'm 34 years old and I'm originally from Pakistan. Back in 2001, the riots between the Asian and white communities here left an indelible mark. Almost 13 years on, has the atmosphere changed? Letting too many in, letting too many of the um, Polish and the Czechs and stuff coming in and, like they said, taking our jobs. I think really we should be looking towards uh, finding jobs for our own. If there is any jobs, then obviously they, they, they go they to them. Them. What, to, to immigrants? To, yeah, they do, because not in a mean no, way. No, 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 yeah, but it is, I, so even so much as, um, say, factory work or anything, yes, like, uh, there's, there's nothing, because... Because they're willing to work, work for less, for less and, do and more hours than we, than we are. And you're Burnley born and bred, yeah? yeah? Born and bred, yeah. I don't feel they're taking over. I feel that they're part of this country now, and that they should share in all jobs. I travel in other parts of, of the country, and it's very cosmopolitan, and, and I don't see why Burnley shouldn't be like that as well. I'd rather go back to how Burnley were. When you were a little girl? Yeah. I don't like change. Not to the degree that we see it around here. I don't really like them. I'd prefer, when you say, mm, who, um, who do you mean? Immigrants? The, the imi yeah. All immigrants? Well, not, not all, but majority of them, yeah. You know, if they weren't here, it'd be a bit easier. Some of those views you might have been expecting and some you might not. What's clear is that this former mill town has changed forever and that the industry that brought migrants here in the first place was just the beginning. So where does that leave us now? It was awful after the riots because then everybody got the opportunity to be racist. We've come a very, very long way in terms of where we were uh, 10 years ago or 12 years ago. Has anyone ever been unkind to you because you weren't born in Britain? No. I, I find it pretty awesome. As long as you speak the, the language, there shouldn't be any problems. But the problem appears when you're unable to communicate, I think. And they're starting to see now that the problem isn't people. The problem is that there isn't work. If you want to come and work, fair enough. But if you want to come and only claim, I think this is not the place to do it. What's yours is yours. And if someone's coming to take it, then you might act defensive about it, but not everyone understands why immigration happens. This topic or this conversation only comes about in times of austerity when things are not going well. And uh, when, when things are not going well, there's always a scapegoat. I feel immigration has done for Burnley and has brought in people from, with different abilities, different knowledges for different things, and everything. When we all work together, we all work. You sound quite proud to be from Burnley, actually. Yeah, I actually am. Uh, it's, it's a good town. Which brings us to our final question. How do these people see themselves? I'm from Burnley. From Burnley. From Burnley. From Burnley. And I'm from Burnley.